The new lineup for Team Scottish Hydro 2013 was revealed at a press conference at the Hilton Hotel in Glasgow. This year, the golfers benefiting are Jack Doherty, Jamie McCleary, George Murray, Andrew MacArthur and Lloyd Saltman. And for the ladies, it's Kylie Walker and Pamela Pretzwell, although both out of the country playing, so unable to attend. After enjoying a couple of seasons on the main tour, George Murray reflected on losing his card at the end of last season and his hopes for the year ahead as part of Team Scottish Hydro. Obviously it was disappointing last year, but at least uh, getting the funding from Team Scottish Hydro is great because it then gives you the freedom to go out and play and hopefully progress back up to European Tour again. George has already had two great results this season and is no doubt looking forward to the year ahead with some familiar faces in amongst his new teammates. I've played with everyone at an amateur level apart from Jack, so I know the guys really well. In my first two years as a professional, I sh room shared with Andrew, and um, so I know everyone really well, and it's a good tight-knit group. One event George will be looking forward to is the Scottish Hydro Challenge in June. I won the Scottish Hydro in 2010. It was a great week. I love Aviemore. We've got a lot of good memories, and I was really relaxed playing up there. So I look forward to going up there again this year and hopefully competing. Another man with his name on that trophy is Jamie McCleary, enjoying his third season with Team Scottish Hydro and hopefully his first without any injury worries. I will be playing a full season this year, which is good. Um, it's going to be the first one since 2010, so as, as having the Hydro Funding's, the hydro funding's been great, I think that the guys we've got on the team, the team now are, are very good and very capable golfers, so I wouldn't be surprised if there's a few guys get their card from there. We've already had a good star, Wendy MacArthur. George has started quite well, so I guess it's just for the other three of us just to kind of catch them up as the season goes on. Andy MacArthur was runner-up in the season opener in India on the Challenge Tour. Last season was a very different story though, and after a slow start, he was more aware than most just how vital the funding from Scottish Hydro was. It was I because I, you know, I've obviously done quite a bit of cash um, early in the season, don't think I'd probably maybe made one cut out my first seven or eight events, you know, I was struggling away, trying like a bear, you know, trying to do everything right, eventually went and saw a putting coach down in Southport, Phil Kenyon, and just ever since then I've been managing to tap them in for three feet as opposed to miss the hole. This year's team will be looking to emulate the success of Craig Lee, Chris Stoke and Callum McCauley, all of whom have graduated onto the main tour from the Challenge Tour with the help of Scottish Hydro. I think with these things, we, you know, success is, is a, the icing on the cake. And what we're here to do is try and help um, the players, the girls and the guys that are involved in it to make their life a little bit easier, just to take a little bit of the financial pressure off them that might make all the difference, as we heard earlier on. It might be the difference between progressing and not, but ultimately that's their aim, that's their goal. So, you know, if you look at Callum and, and Chris and Craig, they, they, that's what they want to do. If we've helped them get there, then fantastic. Um, if we can help other people reach their dreams, then even better. But ultimately, we won't just judge it on whether people qualify and move up um, or progress within the game. We'd like that to happen. Um, but, we, you know, at the end of the day, it's in their hands, and we, if we can help them do that, then great.